What the fuck is wrong with you people? Why in the world are you idiots buying critical collaboration IEMs like they're candies? Literally every week this guy is releasing a terrible IEMs and you guys just go out and buy it. Do you really think Critical cares about you? If so, be warned. I'm about to show you the disgusting truth about this man. Making it quick. Thanks y'all for the memories, but I'll have to leave the server. Dank Pods has been kind of a safe space for my more casual thoughts that I can't really share on my own server, since I'm supposed to be more professional there. But the usual problem of me chatting casually means the more things malicious individuals can take out of context, especially when all of it is on a public server. That's right, bitch. I've read all the egregious things you've had to say. Basically, what happened was, one of his viewers was confused about how to enter his 100k subscriber giveaway. Critical just told him to fuck himself and blocked him. You know, no matter what people have said in my comments, I have not banned a single person. This is the disgusting side of Critical you will not see on his YouTube channel. Before you start crying in the comment section, consider your age. This is a channel for adults. One of the problems many people had with the original Yume had to do with the lack of upper treble extension. The Midnight improves upper treble extension, but it's worse in every other way. Fine, you want a low fidelity 14 dB bass boost for whatever reason, and much more upper treble than what occurs in nature. But you have zero excuse for this 8kHz peak. The king of r slash headphones and r slash headphone advice. Sup or salad? greatly complains about the tuning on the KZZEX Pro, which I exposed in another video. All you dumbasses who didn't listen to me had to pay the price. The Gross RA0402 aims to damp the peak to a reasonable extent. However, this dampening is 4 to 5 dB at the max. The peak on the Yume Midnight is nearly 9 dB in magnitude. In fact, it is even worse than it is on the ZEX Pro. We have a cancerous bass boost and terrible upper treble quality. How in the world is this better than the original Yume? Oh wait, it's not. The C-Audio X-Critical Yume Midnight is complete trash.